Hello. This is the third and final video of our writing small moment section of the packet. In this video, I'm going to take my seed idea of the parachute falling into the book bin during the science showcase and turn it into a story. Before I start, I'm going to look at this chart. Writers add details to their stories by telling what characters do step by step, how characters feel, what characters say, what characters look like, what the setting looks like. I'm going to keep those in mind while I write my story. I sat down and really thought about my story. I thought about different ways I could start and different titles I could give it, but this is what I came up with. The title of my story is Parachute Fail. Now notice that it's kind of a funny title because the story is kind of funny. Your story doesn't have to be funny. It could be something that was surprising or something that scared you. It could be something exciting or maybe even something sad. It could be whatever you want. I chose mine to be silly. This is how I wrote my small moment story on the parachute fail. It was our science showcase day, and I was very excited to experiment at the parachute station. I tossed my parachute into the air and watched as it slowly glided towards the ground. Uh-oh, I yelled when I noticed my parachute was falling towards the books. Crash! My parachute landed right in the dog man book bin. All of my friends laughed. What a silly way to land. My story had an introduction, at least three sentences about what happened, and a conclusion. That is what your story should have as well. When you are done, the back page has a small moment checklist. After you're done with your story, look over the checklist and put a check inside of the boxes. Do I have a beginning, middle, and end? If you do, put a check inside. Is my story about one topic? If it is, check that off. Did I use details? Did I put capital letters at the beginning of my sentences? Did I use punctuation at the ends of my sentences? Do I have a picture that matches my story? Now, since I do not have a picture yet, that is what I'm going to do next. 